La 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 Yep. Ring 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 Yo Hi right, dude All right man Yeah Nice things dude All right man Cool Is whichever kid needed to go to the hospital okay now? <laughs> yeah, he's fine. He's all good. This fucking cocking thing is doing my head in. On the doing Legion now to get new cooking recipes, you have to basically go to this, uh, cook guy in Dalaran and you give him five of any cooking material at a time in the chance that it will become you'll be able to find a recipe out of it all uh, right it's kind of like it works the same way as like the garrison things uh last expansion where you'd like with your profession buildings put in like you know x amount of Um, the you know material like, and yeah. over time you'll get it back. Fair enough. 
but it seems to be a really fucking low chance to actually get a recipe out of her at the moment. It's really annoying. Sounds like fun. Something I'm gonna really enjoy doing. God damn it, I hate it when I log on and there's people trash talking in guild and I don't know who they're talking about because I missed the beginning of the conversation. Well, I'm gonna log out a sec and call my other characters. For one reason and one reason only. I've had a pop up saying I have mail, it's about to expire, and I know I've sent stuff to different characters. Okay, this isn't the right place. I wanna log out in the in bit. It's probably. Just like normal mail you've had for ages because alcoholic tends to do that. I want to check just in case. I know I sent stuff over to my pally not long ago. Well, it might have been like a month ago now. <laughs> Actually, I think I sent it off. Ignored the mail thing because I forgot about her. And then, um,. Have I got mail on this character? I tend to turn that part of Alcoholic off because it becomes annoying. The Legion intends to knock us out of the sky. Meet me in Dalaran over Dead Wind Pass. I have a plan. A horribly dangerous plan. Well, I could probably guess who they're talking about because I looked at the guild log and one of the people whose names I usually see online left the guild. Alright. Apparently, it was like saying the guild master saying, um, I missed what every whisper it says. Seems he feels being part of a guild means he can do what he wants when he wants and screw the guild. <laughs> that one's a naughty little boy then. Or girl. Ah, uh, no, you just said he, so obviously. Uh, somebody else said, on the other hand, you can't really force people to do everything for the guild. And then the guild master said again, but he was not interested in raiding that night, and it offended him that I did ask him to join the raid. <laughs> Whatever, this. If I was in the guild, if I was in the guild so I can have all this stuff, I would miss it. I miss everyone squabbling, it's fun. <laughs> well, this is like something I totally forgot about from being in like a guild that's not just a couple of friends is the constant fucking drama and I really don't miss it. Like, it really makes it tempting just to like fuck off out of a guild. Ah, I used to find it funny, I did. It was never Large, about like, me, like, uh, it was just other people, so I could just laugh at it. But like, uh, when I raided with them the other day, uh, they were sorting out like flasks and stuff. Basically, the guild master were, and uh, they got together loads of flasks and food and stuff into the guild bank. And then, if anybody wanted some, uh, if anybody wanted some of the stuff of it, they like give per half the auction house price in the guild bank, and then they get it. Like, yeah. And then on during our raid, loads of people wanted stuff at the last minute. So she was telling people just to walk up to her basically and open a trade window with her. Yeah. And apparently during that the confusion it seems that she basically traded all the stuff for the tank, which was about fifty grand's worth of stuff, to the wrong person. <laughs> and didn't realize it at the time so has no idea who we got traded to and nobody would like admit it yeah. so somebody basically walked off with literally like fifty thousand golds worth of stuff they can sell on the auction house nice and just shit like that it's like at the time i literally wasn't even inside the raid so they can't fucking blame me for it no but you just never know when you're like newer to a guild like yeah. It's a problem with guilds, really, isn't it? Yeah. Well, it's funny just to laugh at other people being fannies. Over a game.
the prices on stuff like hoobs and that at the moment is ridiculous so yeah <clears throat> it's gone down slightly since the game uh since legion first came out but i still was able to make about five grand off about 40 hoobs nice i wish i had money like that <laughs> coming in <laughs> The fucking reading is stupidly expensive. I haven't got my character up to make the flasks myself yet. So I'm having to buy them. Which, uh, they're a ridiculous amount of money. And I need like three or four at least to raid night like. Yeah. Go oh, tiny chat text is. I need to sort that out. All right, back to Azuno then. Uh, to Stormheim, sorry. Yeah, that's where I think I am now. I used the thingy and teleported with Storm. That's the one. I remember the level. The place. <laughs> sure, Bruce. <laughs> How do you make the text itself bigger then? And yeah, all that stuff, I don't know if you saw it, I was talking about it in like the shade chat on WhatsApp <clears throat> about the nerfs that were gonna happen to like Shadow Priests and stuff. Well, they changed a lot of that and it's nowhere near as bad as it was gonna be. No, that's alright, though. It's like still a slight nerf, but it's also like an extra buff on some other abilities. Cool. Um, where are we going? This way? This way. Apparently as well, I saw on the WoW Reddit loads of pictures of people just flying around grabbing hoobs and all. Yeah. Yeah, they're obviously mo uh, got thingamabobs like exploits or whatever the fuck they're called and just giving themselves the ability to get on flying mounts seriously yeah i can remember i see back in like cataclysm and stuff see with this game i wouldn't want to do something like that because blizzard could just a flat out ban you for being a fanny they will eventually everyone who's doing it like it wasn't long ago where there was this big massive purge of people getting banned like shit loads of people and it turned out to be anyone that even had even like once used fucking exploits on that just got banned all together ah, so like we need to be up there but yeah i can remember in cataclysm and stuff when everybody could fly that the people doing shady shit like that were underground instead they were like yeah. beneath the ground going for the oars and shit. Because obviously that was faster than competing with the people that were flying. But now, um, multiple people can grab the same herb or oar. Makes it fucking easier. It's like oh, once God. one person grabs it, uh, it despawns in a short amount of time, like. But. You know, as an infinite amount of people can grab it in that time. Ooh. It is handy because you don't feel like killing people when they fucking compete with you then. <laughs> yeah, it's a pain now to forget it first. The problem is with skinning, it doesn't work that way. Only one person can do it still. Yeah. Still think when they added like AoE loot in, they should have added AoE skin in. I even noticed now they brought back using like prospecting and stuff for jewel crafting. Yeah. <clears throat> and uh, 
they've added the ability to like prospect multiple things at a time instead of having it to do like five ores at a time you can do like 20 at a time so it's you know a step towards aoe looped in like aoe skin in yeah Two quests. The storm's fury awakens. May the gales exactly. carry you. I wanna make the unit. I think it's the unit frames a bit bigger. The nameplates unit frame. Ah, right. It's not by you. It's across the bridge. And this is a bonus area. Nice. Right, you can use that ability in the middle, which will do, it's like, cycle between a couple of different things. Um, these enemies will, like, respawn really fucking quickly if it's anything like when I did it on my priest. Although I have a feeling a lot of the quest things were like, had they respawn time that shortened really low because the expansion had just come out. Yeah. One second, I'm not doing anything, so I'm going to plug in my headset in before it dies on me. Okay. I, to, I don't know why then, but I was picking up a pad. Do you know why I need a pad? Why? I don't know, so I'm asking, do you know what I need? <laughs> <laughs> uh. It's funny, I was just reading on uh, Reddit and people were saying about Death Knights and they were talking about how basically yeah, they were talking about paladins or something and bringing paladins back to life and somebody was like, yeah, we already do that, they're Death Knights like. And they were talking about how somebody was saying it should have been in the game that you like level a character to level 58 or whatever and then they die and you can raise them as a death knight well, that'd have been cool and apparently that was originally how it was going to be that'd have been cool but then it would have been a pain in the ass you know playing a certain way and then having to change it halfway through your leveling system like. yeah 
Although not really completely different to the fact that Death Lights just start uh, completely, you know, at a high level. Yeah. Also, apparently, the like Arthur's era Death Knights were um, paladins when they were alive. The ones in game are just champions, so may not all have been paladins when they were alive. Whereas the original Death Knights before Arthur's were warlocks. Yeah. They were basically orc warlocks that had their souls put inside uh, Stormwind Knights' bodies, like. Fair enough. Oh, just a 26 XP from that person. <laughs> Study on my shaman because he was actually like completely rested and I like, got loads of bonus XP from the class hall mission thingies. I basically got to level 110 with still like an area and a half left to quest in. Sure. And to unlock world quests at level 110, you need to be friendly with all the uh, factions, like, so you need to do a few quests in each area anyway. Yeah. Uh, apparently using our ability attack loads of things down there, because they're all running to me now. <laughs> That's what we're aggroing the entire bloody world. <laughs> <laughs> be like when Rich used to take us on his mammoth, when we were really low level through like Outland or something, yeah, and see like everything in the fucking <laughs> area to and come after us. <laughs> yeah. Like the thing about, you know, sharks smelling a drop of blood in the ocean and have one coming for miles around. <laughs> yeah. I remember that, he, he took us to Shatrath too, so that we could set our stones there. Yeah. It was easier to get about. I also remember the first Dalaran having to log on as you because you went there and then couldn't, like, get the game back on. <laughs> Yeah. I had to log in as you and get you up to Dalaran. That was fun, It's funny how, like, I don't know if it's just the fact that even the most basic computer is much better compared to what we had back then or what, but Dalaran is as busy as it was back then, and I haven't had a single bit of lag like that. Nah. It was terrible, I was getting, like, more frames per second. <laughs> Whereas I was going like three or something, <laughs> which was still better than you, so I could actually go and get you out of there. Exactly. Annoying, you can't loot these. I know. After a while we're doing the bonus area and just killing random stuff, we also have to close these portals, which this is the last one. And we need to kill one more named guy.
Oh, look, somebody's in a cage. Hero. I made it my goal to taste every brew across these lands. There ain't nothing to worry about when you've got a brew in one hand, your friends beside you. You're in a cage, mate. <laughs> we can all brew, your friends. Fucking trolls, he's probably high. <laughs> he's stormed out of his mind. I thought this guy's name was Moon then. Like the keyboard. <laughs> Shit, you said last time we were going to jump on and do the dungeon. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> Might want to kill us. In this dungeon, be very careful with your tab targeting. Okay. Why? In the sense of, like, when you tend to, like, accidentally attack the wrong thing, this dungeon is, like, full of fucking ads, and people tend to, like, sneak around to be able to kill as, you know, the least amount of possible. <sighs> So people will probably stop bitching if you accidentally aggro shitloads of extra stuff. <laughs> okay. Yeah, they got 200 order resources. I don't know what from, but only. That's why I'm doing the bonus area. Ah, uh, that was the portals, was it? Or was that the quest? We did the quest and the bonus area as well. No, I know, but was the portals the quest or the bonus area? Quest. Oh, no. okay, then. okay, then we were supposed to hand them in up there. Fucking hell. <laughs> Goddamn dragon. I feel sorry for my mouth being stuck under a moonkin. Uh, somebody just linked in general, look, anyone for, and then it's a quest with the like title of it is in some other language, and when you click on it, it comes up in English. Hey, I am finished one of the quests, but closing the portals. I guess they didn't count for both of us. Ah. Oh shit. Well, like, none of them have been closed for you then. Uh... North portal needs to be destroyed. Right, you should be able to see the circle on the map. Point me over that way. I'm not sure which way to go, the bottom way or the top. Like basically listen to deadly boss mods. It's easy enough. Okay. But you are the first straight away we're skipping as much as possible, so like Mad like as people just have to skip most shit like. Yeah. It's annoying especially in like, you know, dungeons where you're leveling. Yeah. As well. 
but I found in like Legion that the dungeons seem to be like a lot bigger. Yeah. And they tend to take more time than dungeons in the past, like. Which is why I've been interrupting things, you douchebag. What's going on? I don't know, he said in uh, chat, interrupts or your friend, because one of the enemies you does an ability that hurts a lot. And I have been interrupting, so we can fuck off. It's really awkward now, it's like almost every class has an interrupt. But a lot of the caster ones, they're interrupted as like a minute cooldown or something. Yeah, so is the way. caster's always your shot on. Usually people would have skipped this group here. So at least he's not skipping everything. Not a boss. Yeah. Basically on this one, he will target a certain person during the fight and he's gonna throw like a javelin thing at you. And you need to place yourself um, with one of the adds that spawns in between you and the boss so that the javelin hits the ad instead. Right. Deadly boss mods will tell you when and it'll also give you a line so you can see where it's gonna be thrown. Sometimes it happens and there's actually no ads left alive, so you're just gonna have to get hit then. But we'll probably be an ad you can hit with it like. How come everyone is fucking doing so much more DPS than me? It's annoying. Ah, we meet again. I think even the healer does more DPS than me. Now it's just you and me and my guard. Probably just out of practice, Mum. Plastic gear is not great. Right. Hate coils, drown them out. I really don't get the way the Dark Moon Fae quest like dumb things work nowadays because I regularly Yeah, the spears on you, you need to get Damn it, I didn't fucking get there in time. Yeah, it was really far away from me that time. But yeah, a lot of the time randomly in the middle of fights or killing trash, I get the deadly boss mods. Uh Fucking the Dark Moon Fae quest like dumbs and just pop up into my bags like. You can't stop. stop DPSing because I was looking at my thing and it's like only through five of the things that are normally on the top bar are appearing. So my uh like thing to make me heal is missing and shit like that. What happens when you use a new UI and don't set it up fully? <laughs> so, where did everyone go? Over your luck. Pete, no. Look at the wrapped up. No. Here. Pete. Yeah. Here. I wasn't running in circles looking for you, honest. <laughs> Also, my celestial something or other isn't on the bar, so it means I can't go into my armored moonkin and start killing shit. Yeah, I've not on my moonkin. I don't know if I've got the wrong ability or what, but I've got a cooldown thing that I thought was the one that gives you all armor. But whenever I use it, I don't get armor. Hmm, strange.
Ist ein Monk da? Goddamn Polymorph. Right, during this boss, listen to deadly boss mods, at certain points you're going to have to stand in the water and at other points you've got to stand on one of the island bits, it'll tell you to get to land or get to water at certain points. Continue the ritual! I will handle these things! Four, three, two, one. Destruction. Land first. Right, water now. A storm is gathering. Four, three. You're gonna have to get to land in a sec. Just wait. In the water. There's no escape. The waters rise. Four, three, two, one. Just watch your wait. land. Ooh, some actual gear. Not a single minus. Nice. This boss in a minute after we kill all this trash. Um, again, just basically listen to Deadly Boss mods. You like at certain points during the fight, he moves underground for a second and then like comes out of a different hole. But then you get like different coloured worm things like him that pop up, and if you get too close to them, they do a lot of damage. So some groups end up killing them, others just fucking ignore them and kill the boss. So. Fair enough. I just need to get my bars sorted to suit this UI. I'm in the rush though. It's not like I'm in a fucking raid. You could probably skin some of this stuff.
game seagull. <laughs> Just killed a poor little seagull. I think it was probably a cove seagull. Oh, okay. Well, I don't think <laughs> like seagulls live in caves. Hey, you never know. Wow, who's locked skin there? Yeah, basically, uh, avoid the big green circles on the floor if they spawn near you. Sometimes you'll get um, a certain ability on you, which Deadly Boss Wars will tell you, and you'll need to basically keep running because the poison stuff will just keep spawning underneath you. And try to, like, you know, run up. Beware. Not into any enemies, but, like, not right by the group. <laughs> you sorry, you lot started fighting the boss while I was, uh, skinning stuff. <laughs> <laughs> oh my fault. Promise. Am I being blown away? Uh, it happens in this fucking dungeon, it's annoying. Beware. You get violent winds every so often. Oh, I hate getting violent winds. <laughs> Easy doesn't stop you from casting. Yeah. It can be annoying with fucking channeled spells though if it like pushes you out of range. Mm. You find a lot in this dungeon as a healer as well that people tend to end up being like out of range of you. And then, you know, if they die, it's their own fucking fault. Might as well, maybe skin of a. That door is a big cop monster. Uh, and they're adding a mount in the next patch that's very similar to that ring saber thingy. Yeah? Yeah. Looks cool. pretty cool. Another boss? Not yet, no. Like, scoot around the edge. Yeah. Ooh, giant snail. Be really careful here. A lot of people don't get run over that bump, but there's loads of moolocks around the side of it. A lot of people like don't see them and then jump into the middle of them. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, these are just trash. The giant trash. I hate being a caster. In the middle of casting your spells and you're constantly getting fucking 
told, no, you gotta move her. The swirly thing. Yeah, it's worse on my priest when, like, I got a long cooldown ability that I got with my artifact, and then uh, it's a channeled ability. So a lot of the time I'll start using it and then, oh look, you have to move, or fucking you get thrown back or something, and then I have to like, fuck up my long cooldown, like. Yeah. Sometimes I've used it in the second I use it, a boss uses a thing that throws you back. Right, this is the boss. Uh, if you get a bubble on you, there'll be loads of shit on the floor you're gonna have to avoid. Uh, but if you get a bubble on you, you need to basically take a lot of damage until the bubble disappears. So, purposely stand in everything that'll hurt you. Including this quake thing. Until the bubble disappears, obviously. I don't think it matters as much in normal. I see a lot of people that don't seem to realise what's going on with our ability like. But damn it, this shit's following me. Don't up, you fucking douche. Yeah, if you got an arcane bomb on you, uh, run so you're not close to anyone. And basically what it is, is you'll get a big swirly thing around you. And the healer should dispel it. But once they dispel it, it just basically stops following you and leaves on the ground. Stays on the ground. You still have to, like, run out of it then. Right. Again, most of this stuff really doesn't matter in normal. It's more for, like, maybe heroic and more uh, mythic but you know <laughs> this next boss is the final boss properly like It's been years! Yes! <laughs> On this next one, there'll be shit loads of stuff to avoid, and you'll be moved by the winds and all stuff like that. But again, just mostly listen to Deadly Boss mods. There'll be big waves like that, and... Cool thing is, for anyone that's got like a execute ability that gets triggered and you can use it after, once the enemy is below 20% health, 
is this thing's staff is set to 20% health, so you can use all that straight away. Cool. You also have to be a bit mindful on this boss of like not ending up out the range of the healer. Would be a good idea to stay in range. There's just so much stuff to avoid on the ground, like. Something, I don't know what it is, but one of the ability things sends you shooting up into the air. But oh, damn it. Trying to run away then because I had the arcane bomb on me. But what happens? I get hit up into the air, so I'm just like by everyone anyway when it comes to spell. Oops, that's okay. 18 gold. Oh, I'm rich now. Quest to hand in as well. Yep, and also I got a, a cloak. I want to see if it's any good for me. Eh, I'll wear it. Not like I really need to worry about anything until I start doing dungeons and raids properly. There you go, I've accepted yeah. that quest as well now. Cool. It's basically it. The end of area thing, plus you would have got a hundred artifact power item just now as well. But yeah, that quest is basically at the end of every area, they send you off to do a specific dungeon. And for most of them, you then get the like pillar of eternity thingy, my Bob, to. Uh, oh yeah, we have to go do that portal all through, don't we? But yeah, you get the pillar of eternity thing to put underneath Dalaran. Which that's what our quest is, sending us underneath Dalaran. You always get a like, dumb level 800 piece of gear as well, which is good. Um... Yeah, just you, you should have like a horn thing next to the quest on the side. Not attacking you, Explain that. Go, are you done? Yeah. Cool. Go hand in then. Should have moved it up the run. You can make an item with leather work in as well, that makes it so that you can't be dismounted by enemies. Yeah? It's like I can make with blacksmithing um, an item so that you can, like, mine and herb and stuff and not get thrown off your mount. I stand and it lasts like an hour or two for normal people and, like, quadruple that amount for a blacksmith. Whereas for you, you can make an item so that you can't get hit off your mount and just like an hour or two of normal people and quadruple that for you. I have taken the next quest and flying now somewhere. Yeah, I'll take you to the top of the building. Well, you're already there, you No, I was killing all the enemies you aggroed. <laughs> I just shadow melded and mounted up in the mouth. <laughs>
thousands of worlds will be mine to conquer! When I did this where I saw my priest, when I got flown up here, there was somebody who had him, like, just about to die. So I basically got one hit on, in on him. <laughs> ah. Didn't even notice. He's been made a mini by this channel of bastard over here. Another one as well. will be mine, you fools! And there's nothing you can do to stop me! We are done here, champion. Let us return to Harvey. These drakes are pretty cool. How do we get one of these out? I stand with you! Because they've got, um, you know, like, the God King's demon ally electric no glow on the um, and, like, stuff. It is time you Um, I think it's... Oh, there we go. It took forever for the fucking dragon to appear for me. Oh, right. <laughs> so he just now appeared. But yeah, these there's usually each expansion you get a new type of dragon and these are the this is the type for this expansion, they're like storm drakes. Although the only mounts I've seen with them I think are all PvP ones. Oh fuck off, PvP shit. I've been expecting you. Try typing in storm thing get Okay, maybe they're not called Storm Dragon. Oh. Goodbye, the great battle. Storm Dragon. The champion. Then. Yes, you are worthy. Bit shit if they run. PvP. Yeah, so far, there's the vindictive gladiator storm dragon. And then there's the cruel gladiators, demonic gladiators, fearless gladiators, ferocious gladiators, and fierce gladiators ones which aren't in the game yet. They look like they're going to be the, like, PvP mount. Uh, for the arena, which, yeah, the one that's in the game so far is for Arena Season 1. Yeah. Basically, you, you can get it if, you know, reach the right rank in the arena, and then the mount is never gettable again. Yeah, we've done the main story in this area now. Cool. What are we going to do now? This is a raid. A dungeon. Ah, uh, right, I thought there's only raids that had a uh, 
Some in stones normally. No, it's always been dungeons as well. Yeah. The hell's this big guy? Right. Uh, that's Odin, the like god dude who's like the leader of the warriors. <laughs> yeah, the beard guy. Asshole. But yeah, who's to Dalaran? Go hand in uh, one from the dungeon. Oh shit, I didn't hurt the Dalaran, I hurt the fucking. It was the wrong hearthstone. Damn it. We go to a different area now, or are we staying in the same place? Go to a different area. We should go to the one where you do my druid quest. Yeah, that's the plan. Oh fuck that, he's garrison. Why have I got my garrison hearthstone still? <laughs> so time's the charm. <laughs> I don't even know why I've got the garrison hearthstone, I should just chuck her in the bank. No, well you'll, yeah, chuck her in the bank. You know, it's handy to like, have another teleport and maybe you'll want, want stuff one day. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. I could be bothered. I've been using it to get the stuff to make bags. That's fair enough. It's a belt from this one. And we'll now have... Oh yeah, you wouldn't have had that achievement yet when you do your quest. But there it stands. But it still might have unlocked another artifact if he runs for you. That we can never repay. Please. Return to Azuna as soon as you this can. This item begins there a quest. Is yet left to do. Did you have a quest item that would begin a quest? It's an ornate weapon. Oh yeah, it's the stuff that I was on about to do with the Dark Moon Fae. Ah, right. How the hell have I got one? You just, if you've got the um, Dark Moon Adventurer's Guide in your inventory, you just randomly fucking get them in dungeons and stuff. Ah, right. But uh, your druid quest is in Val Sharan. Yes. Might want to make sure. Yeah. Alright, uh, we're gonna have to go to the class hall now and go choose Val Sharan on the map thingy. I oh, see my bar. It's not even on my bar for the fucking teleport moonblade. Well, not moonblade anymore, but you know what I mean. Yeah. Um. What's that move called that fucking transforms me into an armored bastard? Oh god, I've got an artifact appearance that much closer to my pink, beautiful, fabulous self. Yeah. I can't see the uh, one that I was on about where you get armor. I can't remember it's fucking cold. If only I could remember what it was called, that would make my life easier. See if I've still got it. Look at my phone now.
I'm gonna go up, just waiting in Dalaran now for you to grab the scouting map thingy for Bal Sharar. Yep. to turn around right now. Knowledge is power, but using it wisely. I yeah, gotta jump on a aeroplane. <laughs> How can I help? Is that a hippogriff? I didn't say that. No, it's because when you fly in for one of the quests, it gives you certain mounts. Ah, right, that's what it is. is it? You only get one of your mounts when you're like flying from Dalaran and just to a random place, whereas like each area has a different kind of mount thing if you fly within that area. Ah, right, like Falchara cool. is these hippogriff thingies. Uh, High Mountain is like eagles. Uh, the area we first did, Azuna, you get fell bats. I think only if you fly from one of the like demon hunter camps, though I'm not sure. It's annoying, but to get the storm dragons now, me and you're gonna have to get good at PvP, man. <laughs> Sign up for these arenas. Which I don't want to do. No, the arena is like, it's like fair enough to like cheap your way through a battleground by like basically being carried by the people who are good at it. Yeah. But an arena would basically be like me and you yeah. against two other people. Yeah, and I mean, kick it would ass, be right? terrible. <laughs> <laughs> There'll be plenty for you to skin in this place. I was wondering what that was then. I used that toy where you get the imp on your head again. Yeah. And then as soon as I got close to landing, it came up in the middle of my screen. Man, are my arms tired. And it's like, because I was flying, <laughs> I thought it was the hippogriff. <laughs> <laughs> How might nature serve? <laughs> That's pretty cool. Wish well, she was the hippogriff. Hey, look, Malfurion is telling me to do yeah, something. Yeah, before you say anything to him, come over here because there's treasure in this house. It's like hidden behind this dressing thingy. Why do you have pretty wings? Toy. And then we have to tell Malfurion that we are ready, and then we ride him. What? Greetings, friend. Oh, Falshara. Every step in this forest brings back precious memories. Ages ago, the first druids. You can ride a stag if he's one, so why can't you ride up the druid stags? The Emerald Dream. You can. Merely an echo. No, you can, can't it? Yeah. You just as can't as ride anyone else's other form. This <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Make ready, hero. We shall soon stand in the presence of the Lord of the Forest. Follow me. Malfurion, thank Elun you've come. It is good to see you again. You must come quickly. Something's happened. There's a legend that some of our ancestors can be found on this world that are not part of the Legion. I bet they're boring. Corruption. <laughs> That's what one of the imps, the imp know. thing just said. It only just appeared. Hand in. How may I aid you? May the winds be at I must protect the wild. May nature 
guy. There's also some treasure over here. It's in the cave of a young us. Is that where you usually spend your free time on? Seems like a poor use of your town. Time. Wow, you are not very good at this. Don't try and be alive when I have need of you next. No, sorry. Do try and be alive when I have need of you next. That uh, imp seems like a bit of a dick. <laughs> I'm on my tundra! There's some treasure here, apparently? Somewhere? Yeah. to track this. Arch druids we need to find, do we? Yeah. Right. Skin the things over here. Why not? They ain't going to. We will not be stopped. We will not be stopped. Treasure over here. We will not be stopped. Yeah, when I was flying over as well, I had three things pop up for um, rays. Yeah. Okay, the thing says there's treasure here, maybe it's like underneath or something. On the roof, man. <laughs> Uh, we can hand in you yeah. the next one. I also leveled up from discovering that area over there. Nice. I'm. 82% through. God damn it, there was an orb here. I was doing the quest first and then it disappeared. Oh, thank you.
this way, man. Ah, oh, who the hell is I following? the wrong direction. <laughs> It's a bonus area as well. There's meant to be treasure here. And again, I can't see anything. Maybe it's behind the building? The witch mother commands it! Nope. These harpies put a poison thing on you, and you can get rid of it by jumping. Yeah. Ooh, there's another roll. Few. Yeah. So I've only got one of three done. Yeah, we've only done one of three. I thought we did a tree earlier just now. Yeah, that wasn't a named one. That was just uh, one of the bonus area. There's a ray over there as well. You see? You see? Elf here be with you, friend of the grove. I got a toy from her. Nice. Flesh and bone to earth and stone. Another roll. If I get one more laced on all, I should be able to finish my mining quest. Nice.
I don't know how much I need for my leather working one. I need to still make that helmet. Because when I was trying it, it was being fucking funny. You know, I was using my leather, not the ones you get good thumbnails. Are you sure you did it right? Because usually you have to, like, tan these certain things which can only be made with the leather they give you. Literally can't be made with your leather, like. On uh, my hunter, when I got the quest thing to do. So you get the recipe for that uh, mounted, dismounted object thingy. Uh, you need to have a hundred leather for that quest as well. Lovely. I had like literally a hundred and one leather on me. <laughs> nice. Yay, my mining quest is complete. I say like, what for getting him up? I didn't notice it was something to mind down there. <laughs> God damn it, just missed the thing we need to kill. Somebody just killed her. Ugh. Curse you! Talon King? You got Alan? From being exalted with one of the ward factions. Guessing we must have completed the bonus area or something because it's not showing up for me now. God damn it! This unit thing is like constantly staying there. Come on! Respawn? There you go. The target. No, it's you turning into something. Yeah. <laughs> I gammon. Yeah, it's a toy turned into a specific tall running guy. And his name is Gammon. You think they'd introduce a pig grace? Name them Gammon? You will follow me. Got a hand in now. Take the long way round. The element of surprise is on our side. Oh. Yeah, and uh, Dark Tigers too. I've just literally uh, gone to. The land of the dead or something? Oh hell. <laughs> cool. So I, I'm assuming I'm probably past halfway through now? Most likely. After the tree of life. Fuck where am I going? Carried on running way past, like like handing to Mr. Tree Guy. Stopping them, no, not time to go for another art druid. Jim. 
That one was Bob. Behold my cart. Curse you, fool! Die! This land is ours now. And Zach. Lord in my UI to see if it gets rid of that fucking Cersei portrait. Whatever the fucking name is. Do you try. Ah, oh, it's a, like as if you targeted to her. No, it's the portrait is just constantly on the screen and it was irritating me. <laughs> was it the thing from de uh, from out, uh, NPC scan? I think it's from this other add on because it's like. Yeah. Different now? No, it's NPC like, scan is different to where we used to be. It's like a big box, golden box with fucking... Yeah, you should have tried yeah. try right clicking it next time. I did. I kept right clicking uh, it and it kept coming back. Alright, may as well set your host on view. It was really fucking into irritating. Feel free to browse. Farewell. Red flame cloud. It's also another quest to take you all. Nice. I wonder why they bothered calling it the red flying cloud, considering there are no other flying clouds. No idea. Maybe they were going to add more before people thought they were shit, so didn't. <sighs> Okay. Where the hell are you? Ah, yeah. Yeah, we'll go nab this ray guy so I can remember where he is. You, I think. He skin a boss, somebody who just killed him, so skin him and before he disappears. What I think this dude might drop a pet. Cool. The one complaining about getting oh fuck off. There's also some treasure we can grab here before he respawns. Ah, there he's respawned. No, just more the resources. You are some more stuff you can skin. Skin! I love skin. Yeah, that cave has now got an old winner. Nice. If he doesn't spawn and attack you again. <laughs> oh, skin. <laughs> hey, Xanthan dude! My battle tag is... Uh, 
Yeah. Try so to bring social up and it's at the top. Heads, hashtag 2837. Yeah, I was playing Darksiders 2 earlier. Um, I've been doing like jumping on, playing and then doing like one dungeon a day and then jumping off. Yeah, I'm not up there, man. There's like, you can drop down, maybe. There's a little cave. Ah, right. Treasure in it. Treasure! Greetings. Where the stars guide you. There's new cell stuff. Then... Heads, P E D Z. Guess you're up there now? No, back down to the quest now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> How's things, anyways, Anthem, do? Still annoyed with that Pokemon thing, the trading card game. I still can't register. Every time I try to register to the site, it takes me to a uh, reset password. I emailed them and everything, and like two weeks ago, no reply from them. Fucking wankers. So treasure over here. I didn't take the quest. I like handed in and then run away from him. Well, no, I didn't need your quest. I'll just kill shit. See, these are furry creatures. They should let me skin them. Everything should be skinnable. Yeah, they count as humanoids. <laughs> World Quest, so eh? I still haven't leveled, I only played the game two, three times a week. And, uh, only for three hours at a time, so it doesn't really get me far. I'm a problem with what I'm playing with now, it's got like 20 characters at level 110. <laughs> I only have two people. at 110 at the moment. <laughs> it's like eight more at level 100. <laughs> yeah, I just don't have the time for that. I other games as well. Um, somewhere here there's treasure, you can like go underneath. Yeah, here we go. Ooh, treasure. I need to get used to this new UI. I keep going to the wrong place to mount up and stuff.
I also need to look at the bars, see what was on my old bar. These are closer to entrapment, okay, Hello. fair enough. Farewell. Uh, another ore. Go grab this quest back here now. Where is your druid quest then? Um, I don't know. Not sure. Uh, let's have a look. Where does it say Druid? Druid, Druid, Druid. Marlon's Refuge. I gotta speak to Brawl Beam and to let Marlon's refu Refuge in Valshahar. Oh, sorry. Wait, does it look like it is on the map? Uh, can you see the flight point, which is to the left of the Archdruid of the Vale? Uh, the Lolathil flight point, is it? Yeah. Right next to that. So right next to the area we we get dropped off when we first come here, then. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. We'll finish with this arc druid for you, and then go do that. All right. Well, I don't know if I'll have enough time soon because like, my hand is gonna go grab the kids and out of there. Well, we'll do it next time we jump on straight away then. Alright. Running too far. I have no idea where you're going. <laughs> Towards you, we're going to the mini map. Uh, yeah. You're really <laughs> far away on my map, like, and then all of a sudden you appeared right next to me, basically. Jinniki. The puncturer. Yeah, he's actually really far away. Oh, so there's someone inside you now, is it? Yeah. I was outside, like, looking, like, where the fuck are they? <laughs> I can't see them. Looks lazy. Click on it, and this big giant babe speaking with a, a woman's voice, like. The dream was clouded with such darkness. In Cenarius's name, a new. Give me a moment to catch my breath, hero. Long years of vigil. We'll go two quests off the bay. Yep. Mission complete. Twisted souls. Nice. It's another bit of XP. Start getting some artifact fucking points soon. I'll maybe do one or two more XP if I can get her. And leave her there. On my warrior yesterday, because I've just been doing the artifact power ones, I literally had like four XP quests uh, uh missions up like. Yeah. The master will destroy your soul! Stupid sleepy druids. Let me show you what happens 
Mr. Heroes. It stirs faceless, forgotten, death. In. I can skin these things. What? Yeah, there's like demon doggy things. Well, normally the demon you like things you can't skin. Yeah, it's because these are dream wolves, so they're like wolfy kind of corrupted thingies. Yeah. They must count as beasts. Which, if they count as beasts, I wonder if my hunter could buy a tame one. They look basically like the mount that uh, you get for the collector's edition of Legion. Yeah. Oh, it's all like the druids walking up. Druids are so lazy, man. Yep. They let um, me do all the quests while they just stand around. Down here and hand in. Sweet. Where shall I strike? In Cenarius's name. A new I will now go to the next quest. Just done down here. I sense powerful magic down below. It's funny when I clicked on her, she said, I'm awake, I'm awake. I just do that, and then I go back to sleep. Yeah, it was brilliant in you, right? He creates these dark manifestations which just doubles of you. And when I did it on my hunter, he created a dark manifestation of my pet, and for some reason it was giant. It filled yeah. the entire fucking room. I've got a screenshot I'll have to show you, it was brilliant. Alright, cool. Anthem, if you play Doom. The new Doom, like, no. Thank you, Mr. Doom. Hand in up there, I'm just gonna quickly grab a hole. You would grab a hole. Yeah, Must this is be. strange. I'll, I'll add you, um. Ugh. It's cold. As I log off. The sleepers have awakened. Choose a reward. In I will travel to the Grove of Cenarius shortly, hero. Thank you for your help here. And with us, this after done.
there's treasure where I am. Osama? There's treasure where I am. Awesome, coming to you. I was uh, sad in check. Uh, my main level, uh, this one, I'm 1-6. Like I said, I only play uh, like twice Over a week. Repeat, repeat, no. Uh, <laughs> Very new and the treasure's like up here. Uh, best dismount. Mm. Yeah, what I got? Artifact. Power. Yeah, I was playing Doom, the new one, the other day, and there was like this really awesome ship like. <laughs> You should get Doom. I don't know if you can run it on your PC or laptop or whatever it is you use, I forget. But you should definitely get it and you should get it on the PS4 or Xbox One. Or laptop if you run on there. But you can rent this if, if you ever come off holiday. Uh, I just outright cancelled because fucking the, I forgot about the holiday and then it ran out and I had to like email them and tell them to basically refund the money and cancel it. Cancelled it? Yeah, it's, I'm just not really playing the consoles at the moment, so, and I can't really <laughs> afford it. <laughs> no, it's, you're addicted to WoW again. <laughs> basically, yeah. <laughs> Right, I'm um, assuming your druid thingy is like close-ish? Uh, no, no. Not, not this one. It's the one above. It's in... Loth... Lorlathil. Unless I've gone the completely wrong way. To where you are. Well, I'm... Close to Lorlathil now. Gold Beak is around somewhere. Yeah, I just ran past. Hey, up. Vishnu Allah. Cheat quest. Dream well. Set quest. Sir. To the shrine, druid. Group of Nightmare. Five. Dark Moon Raiders Sling. Slindra Glance Glade Song Saved. Got the uh, Storm. Uh, storm Tree again, didn't know. The West Wind or something. Yeah, it was the. Drake of uh, the South Wind. South, was it? And your hand in as well as the Arch Druid. Good job, Matt. Alright, that's all the readers you needed. I gotta save this wench over here. One of my quests on my priest was I had to like, kill a hundred demons or like, get a hundred of an item off a demon or something I can't really remember. And these things counted, so I actually stood for you, killing them over and over until it was done. <laughs> you traded in the PS4, that's a shit man. Um, you should get it on the Xbox One then, because um, it's it's like because of how good id software are at making games, it's optimized to run at 60 frames per second, 1080p on all consoles, <laughs> which uh, I think is one of the rare fucking games that does. Altar of Molon, best of I'm guessing that's what that. Yeah. 
The idol, it's gone. Alone. Alone. Soon you will welcome death with open arms. Bring it on, you fucking bitch. And you'd be surprised what, what can, uh, how well he runs on stuff. Just might not be of the best. So done. Have a target. Oh, lovely. <laughs> Fair enough, love. Cool. Why does Gears fall out? I was tempted to pick up Forza from the Horizon 3. Like, um, I grabbed Drive Club, I'm not a massive fan of racing games. I picked it up anyway to play with the Fuji Arcade. Um, I played it every week for months on a Sunday. But, um, with Forza, I'm not sure if that would happen. So I didn't bother, and also it's 50 quid, but you get it on like PC and Xbox One. That's the problem, like, it's like, yeah, get it on you, but pay for it, and then you get it on both things, but it's like 50 fucking quid. 50 fucking quid? What am I doing? Alright, what's your druid quest saying now? First Sata tracks found. Somewhere in this area. What's this? Oh, there's probably a Sata. Out here, no one attacks you. Don't worry, I'm here. Might be different in the UK though. Might be a couple of days later. Tuesday's the regular restate for the US, and then it's Friday, yeah. Might be the 10th. Right, I guess I gotta head back. Close. I smell the stench of Seder to the east. So you go. The quicker you get through these, the better, see, because you can have every class seems to have like a quest then where you have to do multiple missions with a you know really long time. Yeah. You have to do like five of them or something, so it's easier to get this done now, and then you can do those missions all through the app. Yeah. I got to extract information from things. Right. I guard the wild. This is the next. Stark Druid thing to do with the quest, yeah. Yeah, I just handed that in as well. <laughs> and accepted the next quest. Oh, there's a bonus area here as well. Nice. Hey, I'm you fool. You it's also treasure off. upstairs in here. There is little time. Sweet. Death Knight Tank, item level 849. Nice, my level level probably like 600. It's on the balcony here. Alright, sweet. A lot of people are main in Death Knights now, and it's like. Um, just because they knew doesn't mean you have to fucking suck their dick straight away, like. Demon Hunters, I'm guessing, you man. Yeah, what'd I say? Death Knights. Yeah, Demon Hunters. Sorry. They just had a major nerf anyway, so... Demon Hunters? Yep. Why? Because apparently they were too good. Ugh.
Yeah, do you know what exactly we're meant to be doing for your Druid quest? Uh, extracting information from Dark Fiend Satyrs. Now, uh, you're able to uh, attack six to and extract information about the uh, Idol of the Winds. How do I do that? Dark Fiends the lot, I can see. Over you. Maybe you have to like slowly attack air or something. Uh, he said he would tell me nothing, so I killed him. Right. I'll have to do that with a few of them until it. Yeah, six you need to do it too. Treasure here as well. Treasure! Who doesn't love treasure? I just don't love treasure. I hate it. They make maps with the treasure on them to avoid the treasure. We're on the right track. Yeah, I meant uh, Demon Hunters, <laughs> not Death Bikes. <laughs> I can't see any more fucking satires. There's a ray. Uh, use one. Even your sacred shrines are no longer safe from us, Trinity. Also, a ray. I shall kill. I got a level 100 death, right? In tank and spec, but it's only level 100. I um, started the, um, the stuff, fusion. more satyrs. The annoying thing is, is because this quest is done in this area and like a bonus area and stuff, people are just going to be killing them. You just want. Satyrs. <laughs> I keep calling them wrong. They satyrs. Get it right, Reese. You <laughs> <just get> told. <laughs> They're not very nice, these satyrs, are they? Be like, I will fuck you up! And it's like, no, oh, I just want a bit of information. Your sacred relics, druid, now face me! Then I murder them. <sighs> Another one? Fuck, are they all? That one? Or an imp? 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 Go with an imp. Two over here as well by the water. I was just over there. The idol is ours. I'll never give up this location. What race are you with that man? By the water? Q, where the other druid is attacking. There's one over you. Azius, the god. 
Organ. Nice. Organ are cool as fuck. East of the veil. We'll meet you there. Hey, also six done. Gold beak again. Gold beak must be nearby. Uh, almost uh, done the bonus area. There we go. We can go hunt the new quest and see what's next. What happened to there? I gotta actually do another part of the quest. I gotta find the idol of the wind. Now, I love the wild. Wind. I thought so. I just checked because I had a feeling the pronunciation is different in the US and the UK. Yeah. Yeah, it's satire here, Sata in America. Yeah, fair enough. I'm pretty sure it comes from like Saturn and all that bollocks, so. No idea. Yeah, how the fuck do we get it? It's up here, maybe? I never did get all the sea turtles from the Pandara person. For justice, the light smiles upon us. No idea what you're on about. The turtles, they're not sea turtles, they're just turtles. Um, for Pandaras, Pandar, Pandarians, fucking race mounts. Ah, uh, right, yeah. Last thing that was after I came back to the game, I realized that. I needed to get somebody too exalted with them, or roll a panda, which I just got exalted with them instead. And that got me like an extra six months. Nice. Right, I'm in the right area, but I can't see what this idol is. Underneath, I'm guessing, there's caves. Is there anything to do with this dude? Yes, you have to kill him for your quest. I can't even see him. <laughs> Drop down, look, there's a path here. It's like right underneath where you are. I would heal myself, but they're off my bar now. It's really irritating. Put them on your bar then. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to. Well done, Archdruid. Take the idol back to the Dream Grove, and we will meet you there. Uh, you have to take it back to your class hall now. Alright, cool. That's not the end of it, is it? It's very short. That's just the first part of it. Ah, uh, right, so there's different parts, like... Yeah, there's like... You can only do so much now, and then there'll be more to do at level 100 and 10. But yeah, as I'm assuming you're jumping off soon, I'll let you, like, go to your class and sort that out, and 
I'll go back to Dalaran. Yeah, I'm gonna jump off in a minute, literally. Because it's ten past and they won't fucking all leave you on the soon, so. It needs to be done. I gotta get used to this new UI, UI and I need to sort this so that the text is readable. It's like it says change text size for the the chat now and you do it and it only changes the title like where it says general and log. Yeah. General log. Level one, 107 now, aren't we? Yeah. Nice. We'll do far then until we hit 100. At some point I have to jump on again, mate. Yeah, one time. Uh, are you gonna jump on and do the, uh, what's called quest, the second on fact? Weapon. Yeah. It's like, well, there's more than just the sight gun, you'll be able to do all the other three of you and two for me. So yeah. obviously I haven't done them yet, because I didn't want to get the XP from them. And like, separate, separate us even more. Yeah, I'll have to do them at some point soon, like, I'll probably jump on in the day. Probably jump on tomorrow at 9, like I did today, and do... The next bit of Dark Siders, and then before the kids come home, I'll try and jump on and do the other stuff. Yeah. And anyway, I'm gonna end the stream here now. Oh, no, I'm not. Actually, I'm gonna hand in first. <laughs> what am I fucking doing? Come here, I forgot to actually hand it. Nature is restless. Continue. Do not stray from the fire. Until mm. Return to me when you've gathered enough essence of the wilds, Arch. We are nature's I trust guardians. none other to accomplish this difficult task. There's scenarios. two different quests now. Druid of the Claw and something else. Some of them will probably be to unlock like new people to send on your missions. You just literally go in there and hand it straight in as you get there to like get a new person. Good, I need more people. You'll probably also now get the ability to like, when you get those troop things, you can get a second type of those. Yeah, cool. I stand and then there'll most likely be a mission to do like five uh, quests to do like five mission things. To restore the injured and the resurrect the it usually is. Thank you, Archdruid. Okay, fair enough. Which obviously you'll want to start queuing the first one up and then yeah, I've got sort them out already. on the app. The skies call out for aid. Anymore. Catch you later, Xanthan, dude. Gather in the Dreamweaver. To retrieve druids by completing Gathering the Weaver's mission. Right. Wow, still a long one. It's eight hours. Yeah, that's what I mean, and you're gonna have to do that like five times, I'm guessing. So that's why it's best to like start doing that now and then sorting it with the app. Well, let me select them. Like the two people that I've got. Ah, oh, they're on a mission. It's these two that I can collect. I am nature's rage! For a loon. Oh, I'll risk it. It's only 90%. What, 90%? Yeah, uh, that should be fine. Yeah. Right, I'm going to jump off and I'll catch you later. Um, yeah. Yeah, so I'll see you soon. It's all right, man. It's all right, dude. And goodbye for anyone who's watching the stream. Thank you for tuning in, and I shall see you soon too. As in tonight. <laughs>